or loadout. Uh, it's a little awkward to get started. Let's see if I can remember how any of this works. Uh, yeah, it's really hard to get that stupid chest this early. Yeah, it's annoying. I don't want to do the self damage for no reason until I get the. Pinch isn't too bad. That's what I'm do. Oh, actually, that's probably the best way to do it. It doesn't cost me any health to do it that way. Wow, this is super annoying. This thing barely attacks. do something that would be kind of silly. I mean, one of these two. Okay, this is probably a League of Le Legends reference. It's, it's uh, the name of an ability. It's been a while since I've played that. My internet has been kind of... has had some ping spikes on this computer, so I don't get to play League of Legends anymore. That's kind of interesting. I might take the Golden Cat. I need... I mean, I, I do need the Mana Gems at some point. Am I just gonna fat deck it? Are you kidding me? And you can't just keep doing it until you miss. Is that how that works? Holy crap. You need skills to make it work, but that's... Yes, that, that is a thing. It's kind of 
hilarious. Uh, the cat likes me to take skills, and then a, a shield catch is... It's pretty guilt-free kind of thing. So, if I just want to spell spam... Like, this is good with spell spam and, and just general fat decking. So, like, for example... Stuff like the deck slam or the deck shield. Or just anything that that generates mana. I'm still gonna leave my options open. I, I don't feel super confident that anything in particular is super good here. Uh, I don't know how I do this. There we go. Times out as well. Does it reset the timer whenever you cast it? It's kind of a question. Oh, I dodged. Damn it. Oh my god, that this, this guy is so annoying. He only steps away for a brief moment. Like, no, it wasn't what I thought it was. How do I do this? Oh, nice. Wasn't enough. Wow. I could just kill the hostage. It was bad. I can just get one soul link. I can self-harm for the rest. spell buff it actually catch me off is just really really about the most annoying way that you could cap yourself off okay don't need the fire hopefully I can uh, there's no way I want to bust the chest in time well wait the bouncy blade the bouncy blade can do it I just need this get away with missing because of the icicles. Did I get it? I think I got it. Alright, that's reassuring, I guess. That bouncing blade is just gonna murder enemies who stand still. Flow gives you spell power. Okay. I, I kind of like that. Backstab is really bad because it goes through shields. So if I wanted to depend on shields, I would be in some trouble with that. But this this is good for spell spam. It puts free puts free spells in your it's a free spell in your deck and it costs one. Uh, I guess that's all right. Maybe I, I maybe I want to go with the harpoon though. does something. I don't know, Harpoon's a pretty good relic. I'll, I'll just go... I'll just start trying to pick up Hearth. It's, it's gonna be pretty inconsistent at best for a while, but it'll get places eventually. Wow, it's gonna take a while, but it'll happen.
that. It's no nonsense. It's just, just it's, it's a really good artifact and enabler. It's just. Effects yet, but I mean, some of those effects are pretty good, even as those artifacts, even just one is sometimes a really good standalone justification for it. Pacifist run? Is that how you... Right, Pacifist is how you unlock the... Going for the skin unlock, so... Oh, okay. It follows you. Or it somewhat follows you. When it hits the enemy, it goes toward your current tile, but then it, it doesn't track you any farther. Okay, that's it. Oh. Like to not take more damage, okay. I need healing, I need flow. I guess a root. The bouncing plate would be pretty busted if I could if I could set it up. Ooh, I can't save this. Is there anything that can save it? I don't think so. That's too expensive for. If I just want to spell spam, I, I don't know. It's really good though. I don't have four mana either. Oh, look 
But that, oh god, that, but then you lose a lot of mana regen. I can't, not right now, that would be, things would be really unpleasant for a while if I did that. About to hit a store. I could YOLO it. I don't have a lot of money though. Like if I had to re-roll to get to, 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 to look for for mana region. I don't know. Am I really super duper looking to scale up my defense?
better if you can dash, but um, it's pretty annoying. I don't think I'm gonna like that. The scramble. I don't know if I have enough. I can't just face tank. I don't think I don't. I don't have enough armor often enough. I can. Oh, I don't know. It's rare. Never used it before. This is probably a really bad fight for it. I'm not sure. There probably were ways to still win that. But mana regen to get through my deck rapidly so I could actually get to my shields it was probably a better idea. Just, okay, I need to do damage somehow. not what I really want, but that card does a better job than anything that I have right now. And this, there's nothing I can do about. I just want to go crazy on, on the lengths. Oof, that was bad. right now like do I really is that really what I'm doing
didn't find that very impressive. That relic would have been okay if I, if I were doing Kanai's. I don't know, none of these have been all that convincing so far. 93 gold. I mean, I, I could get one thing that's really good, or, and maybe even a pack or two. Or I could just get the health, the guaranteed health. If I do well in the boss fight, I heal for 400.
walk the lasers and then move afterward. So I'll free choice when I leave the crack tile behind. Almost there, I just need to... Now 
to get the flame synergy. Uh, should increase some shuffle time. Not as good. Flow synergy it has nothing, it's not really taking off yet. I'm finding myself a little bit annoyed. Oh, don't do that, that's eventually gonna be bad. generates flow, is it? But it's, it might be a... I mean, it generates a lot of flow. It's a pretty good stopgap. It's really awkward to work with. I'd rather just have a lot of spells. Could take a while, though, for that to happen. Trinity it turns into poison. That's interesting. That's, that. Those are both kind of interesting. The one that's...
sort of a synergy. I don't have a ton of things that interact with that just yet. Yourself, even if, if you're like, if you're standing on those tiles, so you 
just gotta watch out. Should be pretty simple to dodge though. My upgrading, this is this would be a, a pretty good double cast right here, actually. Yeah. I think I have to. This would also be a pretty good double cast. or hard efficiency. This one's also not bad. That's probably better than skipping, but it's probably the weakest option right now. Double cast means I lose flow twice. That's kind of a um, secondary consideration long term, but it's maybe it tilts. That's gonna be my reason anyway. really early for that, but I, I it could be. Oh yeah, that one's... Easier land. Well, 80 versus 120. The times two just means there's two rows. It doesn't actually hit a single enemy twice under any circumstance. Not that I, not that I think, not that I believe it. It's not a very good demo. Show it. Show it the version where you actually hit them. Just now, it's just showing that you can't break the same tile twice. Yeah, it only hits once. Less damage, but it's much a lot easier to land. Oh, 
crazy. I lost like a hundred. damage that time. Oh, I, had, I almost got to push W. But I didn't. Uh, that's okay. I wasn't, I was not in love with my early pickups. Just, I don't like re-rolling. I don't, I'm not actually losing on purpose. It just looks that way. Thunder, you're a weird one. You're a really weird one. I, I mean... Could be good. I just had to stop failing. I don't know. But I just want to block Cactus Vines. Please. Fat deck and, and just go all flanks. Yeah. I mean, if you're killing enemies, then it's probably a minor encounter, and then. If you can kill them, then you don't really. I mean, how much do you need shields if you're just killing them in the first place? It's kinda. helps you. Like, yeah. You're already doing well enough by the time you can even use it. I mean, there is like a gray area in between where it shines, but uh, these are not, none of these are like super generically great. For a fat deck, mana potion is fine. That's spell again. I'm just prolonging this. I just like don't deal damage yet at all. This is the silliest. Why did I do it? Why did I do it this way? 
No, that was not the right button to push there. Am I, I timed it right? It should have, but maybe there's something about it that it's just unblockable. I wish I understood things, because then stuff would be a lot better. But I can actually start doing dealing with damage with it. I don't have enough damage. I'm pulling in opposite directions. And this one's kind of intermediate. I think I want to go big with that spell though. Pinch, it's like maybe there are some weird, really weird things where that actually is, is useful, but usually you just want to use Corset and hit uh... Wow, I did that wrong. How about that Pierce? I thought we hit both of them, that's not how it works. Ah, uh, shield throw. That kind of synergizes with Haven. It's really dangerous, but right now I don't really do anything. I need to... I don't know. I might remove it later if I get something else to work, because it's sort of frustrating. I would like to draw my other shield before I play the one that I can't even play. There we go, finally. Play it for 
100? I don't think so. There we go, that's better. I have to be really careful when I... It's like a very dangerous game. Payoff is, could potentially be substantial. I think I just hit there, and then, oh, I lost a bunch of shields. Oh, nice little double cast. Yes. Oh, he dodged it. I'm back up to 60, though. How did I... Did, did, did I hit by the... had an AOE in. Yeah. I botched it.
that's that's two manic crystals away from being playable. playable without medkit, but I'm right now I'm screwing up a lot and I'm not closing out fights easily. I think I just heal because I'm hoping to figure out later. It's not like it's not like I had one particular relic that was really good.
everyone. I didn't time that super wrong. If I had thrown my shield and then taken the explosion while I was on the return trip, I'd be mad at myself. Uh, it's a pretty good gamble because if I lose 200, I don't, I, I don't have 200 to lose. Yeah. Unlucky. Now they want me to remove spells, which I'm sure maybe. Still no synergies. So uh, I'm not sure I like deck shield. I'm not sure I like anything right now. Paint a lot for 45. Is what it would do right now. should have just started. I needed to cast Haven. I I don't remember how, how far up or down the list it was initially, but if I could have gotten to play Haven, then that would have been... Uh, maybe it would have worked out. These are just not good. At least they're not good right now, and I don't know how to make them good.
learn something. Uh, all right. Okay, big spells. Is that enough? Shields up. Shield beam is also kind of alright, but shields up is just less things to think about. Like, shield beam sometimes in a really crowded room gives you more shields, but it's. It's just taking forever. It'd be nice if I... There 
will be fights where I can't just turtle endlessly. Deck. Am I just... Oh, I'm focusing on Phalanx, that's why it's going this way. That's okay. They haven't given me a reason to focus anything else. Attention keeps doing this, this split, and I keep looking at the wrong thing at the wrong time. That's sort of interesting, I'm a bit late for that. It's 
you're too late for basically anything. This is... I don't know. It doesn't seem like a very big number, I mean... I, this doesn't seem like that much. It's nice and all, but it's like, eh. Faster. Oh, how did I even get that kill? I don't even know. I'm not gonna ask this question. It seems, uh, I'll take it. Okay, that's one synergy with Fragile. Where are the rest of my synergies? Those are not synergies.
something I actually need. Is there any synergy whatsoever? Or can I I'll just take it because I hope it might do something eventually. It's peace of mind, like I want to upgrade something that costs four. I don't ever have to second guess. seem all that fun or like that's how I want to that I really want to do. Sometimes I can be really good. 
Dodging it on, on every other character, I would just dodge in that situation. Do I really want that? Uh, yeah, I guess I do. Oh, I'll see you again already. I don't know, a hired gun could do some work at this stage of the game. shots and the mana refund.
Is Ice actually having spells that deal damage? spells are pretty easy to land here, so yeah. Alright, nice little tiny bit of insurance policy. Uh, I probably need removes. I'm not even sure what, what I want to remove. I think Anubis might be... might not be as as good as I might hope that it would be, but I could still get better relics later. Cold stone is right now. It's good, but it's, it's it's not how it's not how boss fights are won. I don't know, tough call. It doesn't seem like a lot. I need more Trinity if I'm gonna have enough flow to actually use this. It does generate its own flow though. Are these things that I can handle? Looks kinda scary. What would I do if I had 25 money? So it's a donate blood. This is too scary. I don't know. If I push my buttons fast enough, then I can always generate more shields. 
I don't know. Oh god, I, I just don't, don't have shields really. I just have to steal skin and then course it. If I don't get that combo, then it's hard to jump start it. So that's kind of scary. Focus, that would be pretty, pretty crazy. Yes, there it is. Okay. Oh, crap. I had double cast on the brain. I thought I was double casting the spell that I just wasted. Failed to raise the power of the spell. I need the Trinity Barrier. You're probably never going to be good. I don't have enough Trinity or Flow to make this good. And again, I don't have any shields. It's, it's a tough call. Nothing's good right now. Guns doing some work. I mean, I just want to remove a bunch of crap. Set up just for a mana gen, even if it doesn't do anything yet. It could be really good later. Hitting spells, the one that the soul fire or whatever is probably the one I really wanted to end with, but it didn't happen. 
These are alright, but not for the deck that I have right now. Like, where's the Trinity? I've been fishing f for, for uh, Trinity, but it never happens. spells so I can just spam. That's not what these are. That's it's pretty interesting. I'm not sure it's what I really need. It's like only good for cheap spells, but a lot of my spells are cheap, but oh, a few of them are very much not. I would probably screw it up. This, this, if I had time to think and plan, this would be good, but in the spur of the moment, I make too many mistakes with that kind of thing. Upgrade, remove. I mean, it's just, none of these are horrible, it's just there's too much interference. But not, nothing in particular is super horrible. the shot, and I don't even know which. I would have to adapt on the fly to whatever I end up learning. I just don't want to. That could be a double cast, but I can't afford it. That's the one I want to double cast, I guess. Also be a good. That's when I thought I was double cast, but it wasn't. But no, I'd rather have the actual double cast so I don't get screwed up. Better than I thought it was. 
And I don't know how. So it feels like I keep trying to get centered because that never happened. So I didn't land my last hitters either. I'm just screwing up. I've got too much of a fat deck for that. It's too bad though. or so for, for this to pay off. Actually, that's better, yeah. There's no store in this chapter. No, no, not the path that I'm on, anyway. I, mean, I don't have enough health for that. Yeah, okay. I think it's an easy choice. Dude, 
badly. I wanted to fit last hit with something else, but I couldn't. Uh, nope, nope, nope. Big scaling spell, but I can't basically can't ever use it because it has the scale and it's actually going to continue to dis be you know to disappoint me. Or is it not technically dead because of the spare re uh, decision? I don't know. Uh, okay, let's just keep going. Did the numbers get bigger? How much was it? I thought it was 200. I forget. Oh, I got it. Just, I think I should just stay away.
exactly how this skill works, but the fact that I get maximum health when I cast it is tempting. Hopefully it doesn't erase the shields that I already had, but we'll find out. Maybe we can find out right now. Oh, you can't gain shields during the test screen, that's kind of annoying and stupid. Let's find out how it works. Oh, I don't. I can't. I have like a. Well, I have ten. It's more than nothing. Yes. Okay. So it's 999 is not the absolute limit. Okay. Last hit. Generator. A lot of dancing, but it's doable. Oh, yes, that's the last hit right there, yes. Oh, I've got poison. I need to finish this as fast as I can. Poison goes through shields, that's always important to remember. Double cast. Hmm. I don't know, most of those statuses are not that useful right now. Cheap shields are kinda nice. Badge is tempting. Uh, how, much, how much longer is it? I'm long enough to matter. I could be like, I could easily be three or four spell power, maybe more, quite possibly less. Med kit, I could. I don't know, I get to hit a store. When I go to the store, I'm gonna keep in mind. When I go to the store, but maybe consider buying a heal if they offer me one. It's a little bit late for Golden Cat. Like a mana Vein? Do I... I don't think I need a Mana Vein. Not if it costs me 90. I, I, I think I just want to do a reroll and hope for something better. Okay, the next battle is not a boss. This is pretty irritating. Perhaps manageable. How much shields do I have? I'll do it. Okay. These are no. I just want to re-roll re and hope for some, save money for a break. I'm sort of close to maxing out my. That just takes up one of the slots, and potentially I could have to remove it. I don't know if that's something I want to worry about. It's only 10 money, though. Oops. Small benefit. And then the cost... If the cost didn't matter, it ends up mattering, I'd be really mad. Another mana vein. These are just... Not the enabling stuff that I I really want here. That could be annoying. If I could get some healing, that would be really nice. But I don't know. Uh, there we go. It's almost an auto buy. Let me just double check that I'm not. Something really important by doing that. This is sort of sort of a maybe. Ouch. That's just one battle though. But this one is is 
Two mana, there are a lot of spells I would not be able to cast at all, and then half mana regen for the boss fight it would be pretty dreadful. I think I just pinned a little on the med kit here, and maybe. Even with, even with just the spell power, this is kind of alright. I'm not. I don't know. I don't even need Anubis anymore. Not a, not especially, it's not bad. But it's not really good either. Is it worth money to get rid of it or would I rather upgrade? Two packs that worked against me. 
really scary. Yes, yes, look at that, I've got the poison vial. 
resistance strain. That's just a nice combo. Uh, let's see. Do I just want to be at full health for the fight, or do I just want to assume that I'm going to play well? Oh. I mean, I deserve to lose if I actually need that much health right now. This is the first time I've fought the max, or beaten the top, the maximum tier. Celice, or Celice. I think it's Celice. It's like, like you're slicing. It's pronounced just very subtly differently because of the extra vowel. But basically, it's Slicey. I don't know, that's my guess anyway. Uh. I do not need to double cast that, that's just kinda dumb. Okay, yes. It's a bit late, but 
cast that, does it gain the scale twice if, it, if they're both kills? That's kind of a question. Uh, I don't know, I'll take the money. This I don't know, sometimes this needs free skill shots early in the fight, but I don't know, it really depends. I'll just take the money. A bit late for both of these. This one is, gives me a little bit more flexibility. I, I think I'm feeling the mana regen though. Oh god, I'm almost at the end. Don't want to screw this up. I just I really like this spell. It's just it's just good front loaded damage. Clear out the room. This is so forgiving right here. I like that too. I'm never gonna have a fifth mana point. Um, upgrades would be nice, but all of the things I really want to upgrade, I don't have enough mana to deal with them if they're too expensive. Like, double cast barrier could be somewhat good. It's not gonna get super big. Either upgrade the barrier or I just get another mana vein. They're both not very exciting. I guess the barrier has a stronger best case. Oh, I have enough for a remove. I should remove. I should figure out what am I getting rid of. There has to be something that's. There's each of these that there's there's there is some argument for keeping basically each of these. Anubis, maybe I can get rid of just to make my deck go faster, but it only costs one. It doesn't, it doesn't feel too horrible. Maybe I just save my money. Oh, that's nice panic button for this fight. There's something 
that are hard to dodge. And you have the wrong spells. You don't have to dodge. You have that. to them. That's kind of smart. That's good. Okay, let's go team friendship. Did I... Let me double check. Is it let me double check? Uh, there it is. Team friendship. Everybody's alive. So that's good. That's right, it's not over. There's like a sequel. Or is it? Is this just the ending? I think it's just the ending. It's not like an extra level. That's right, the genocide ending is where you have to actually fight inside of the base. Level 1 is just really annoying with this loadout. It's some very specific situations where they th where they throw a lot of projectiles at you and it shines, but uh, you, you just really need good shuffle luck, you need to get good cards fast, and you need enemies who actively help you kill them for the first, you know, couple of battles. But uh, yeah, one of the things about this game is like, I don't know, I feel like some of the starter is like not that super impactful for the late game. If you get far enough, it just kind of almost doesn't matter who you picked. Not sure what they should should do about it. And it's not always true. Sometimes it's it's sometimes it's really important throughout the run. Or, you know. But yeah, often enough that it's, I feel like it's a legitimate concern. credits.
Yes, alright, so... Unlock some stuff. Apparently... I'm, apparently I'm capped out. I don't know if you, if you do, like, higher difficulties, if you... If you can unlock higher things, or if it's just totally unlocked at this point, I don't know. A completionist, I guess it's not that awesome, but it's, I mean, it's, it's cooler than the default, I think. Default is kind of old-fashioned, looks like, uh, looks like mint ice cream or something, kind of white and green color palette. shots you get you basically farm half a point of mana I th think this since the cost is zero and it just says that you lose half a point of mana I think it can I think you can fire it while, while completely manaless and it just floors you back down to zero and yeah you just get your first mana point right away so that's pretty cool I mean, by the late game, you just want, you probably want some better mana regeneration solution that's a little bit easier and faster, but this is like, yeah, if it's the first half or two-thirds of the game, that could be a big deal. It's sort of interesting, I don't know, it's kind of edge case. I guess it's nothing to dismiss outright, you just remember to make use of it. But it's like, okay, so while you shuffle, you do 10 damage per attack, and you gain each of those attacks. If they all hit, you, you go positive by half a mana point each, in addition to your base regen. So it's like, you could just load up on mana crystals, and, use your, and you regenerate mana that way. Starts with blue bullets. Okay, so yeah, that's another reason. So he he likes mana crystals, and he doesn't. I guess they're reinforcing that notion. Oh my god, innervate. That's a synergy. Yeah, you fish for spell power. You just play. I guess you try to go hard on convergence. I guess it's kind of this loadout seems to be more convergence fo focused for sure. You can also play a jam deck because you have one jam card just that you start with, but uh, probably wouldn't go too crazy on the jams. I'd probably just my first thought would be to just yeah look for conversions build just mana and spell power because blue bullets hits 20 times. I mean. Just get rid of these. They're not terrible. Well, this one is sort of. Yeah. I mean, it's fine. It's. And that one's fine, I guess. This one, I think you can. Hit... Well, I don't remember. I've never actually taken it. I think I know I've seen the tool tips before. Is there pre? Okay, it's just three tiles away. They can chain react. If they hit an enemy, they just explode immediately in blank tile. Oh. So let's see what happens when you hit them directly. There's, is there a radius? It didn't look like a radius. 
this that's one where it looks like there was a radius. Could be wrong though. Because if there's a radius, that could have implications for how to handle the hostage rooms. Like, do you plant it diagonally from the enemy and then shoot it, or can you just drop it directly on the enemy? And there's looks like there's a yellow explosion box when there's an actual explosion, but when you hit point blank, there's no radius. Huh. I'm overanalyzing this. I was just gonna call. I was just gonna cut off the stream, but now I'm tempted to try this. But maybe I'll do it next time. Yeah, good stuff. I didn't think I was gonna like this character, but now that I've sat down and actually read what the things do. These aren't bad starter spells, so yeah, we probably do want to just remove them. Uh, I don't know. I hate to be super dismissive, but maybe you do just remove those and like, like you just hit the ground running, you just scale up the blue bullets and you just go nuts. Is that just how this works? starter spells, and that's already a, basically a combo. It's pretty nuts. I don't know. We'll see if it's as we'll see if it's as powerful as I think it is. It might it might be a little bit slow scaling. It might need a little bit of help from your relics, but it seems pretty satisfying. I guess we'll find out. You'll probably want to. I want a couple of shields, one or, one or two shields in the deck too. So maybe you start with flanks and you pivot back to convergence. Get some consume spells for max health to the usual. Yeah, it should work. But anyway, that's it. I'm, I'm done.